The National Agency for Food and Drug Administration and Control, NAVDAC, has declared war against drug hawkers and those ripening fruit with carbide. Director General of NAVDAC, Professor Mojisola Adeyeye, made the declaration at the official flag off of the agency's media sensitization workshop on the dangers of drug hawking and ripening of fruit with calcium carbides in Abuja. Professor Adeyeye said the menace of drug hawking poses a serious challenge to the health care delivery in the country, adding that the agency is resolved to eradicate the illicit trade. Any drug hawker arrested by NAVDA will be prosecuted, will face a jail term, and our enforcement officers are currently carrying out synchronized nationwide operation. We want to put an end to drug hawking. She added that ripening of fruit with calcium carbide is dangerous as it causes disease like cancer, heart failure, and other deadly illnesses. They may also cause frequent thirst, irritation in mouth and nose, weakness, permanent skin damage, difficulty in swallowing, vomiting, skin ulcer, and so on. Higher exposure may cause undesired fluid buildup in lungs of pulmonary edema. Some resource persons from the agency also spoke on the dangers of the illicit trade and some measures put in place by the agencies to totally eradicate the menace. We have an estimated 600 million cases of foodborne illnesses annually. And this is, uh, if you do the math, it's about 1 in 10 people. Calcium carbide is a very dangerous chemical. And that is exactly why we are here. And it's being used. I don't know if it is because of ignorance, as my DG said, or it's deliberate. Somebody decided to be just deliberately wicked to his fellow human being because I don't believe those people that are using all those things, they eat it, those same things that they are poisoning. I don't Meanwhile, NAVDAC has resolved to work with security agencies to arrest and prosecute offenders as well as intensify publicity of its regulatory activities to the grassroots. Justin Asande, CNN News.